Hallo, Katrin hier with European Paper Crafts in the US. Welcome to my channel or welcome back. I am so glad you made it here. Today I have two brand new paper packs for you. I have two packs of great ephemera and other embellishments. So let's get started. This week I have crafted with new products from a line called Farmstead Easter and it is by Violet Studio. And I have four articles in my store. First of all, these very pretty ribbons already tied to bows, really cute and small enough for cards. Then a pack of card toppers, there are 28 pieces. And these are almost, uh, so this is cardstock. It's almost like shipboard. They're pretty sturdy. There is a pack of sentiment stickers, 44 pieces. So there are two of these sheets in here and it's got all these beautiful Easter and spring greetings and you will see them on my cards. And then there is this very fun paper pack. This is a six by six paper pack. It has 16 designs. There are single sided and in there twice. So you have 32 sheets in here and there are 180 GSM. So I made cards with it, but um, I thought I'd show you at least the papers. You will see them on my cards, but here, look how beautiful and fun they are. I just love these. I haven't seen anything like it yet. Look at all these creatures here on this beautiful bluish background. Uh, the, the paper is strong enough to make cards out of it and you will see how I did it. Check out more happy Easter wreaths. Have a lovely Easter. Beautiful. A stripe. Yellow, always fun for Easter and spring, flowers and dots. Then these cute Easter eggs. More bunnies in the meadow. There is a blue and also a pink gingham. Look at this, really, really fun. Lots of beautiful papers in there. So 32 sheets. Even one big one, Happy Easter. And then all these, like I said, all these cute little bunnies and, and creatures for spring. Just love this paper pack. Now, um, yeah, let's see what I have created. So I made a lot of cards and let's start with this one right here. Happy Easter. So these are all top folding cards now. And I used double... Um, sided cardstock so you have actually uh, a green on the outside and then uh, reddish orange pink i don't know what this color is it's it's very pretty uh, on the inside so that's why i also added a white panel to write on but um yeah this cardstock i had in my stash this was um 12 by 12 and it came in one of the spring packs probably two years ago. I want to say it was a Spellbinders, but I'm not 100% sure. So I um, I couldn't find it anymore. Otherwise, I would have linked it. But um, yeah, this I'm sure you have some other cardstock that will work. So I made these A2 cards. And here is a frame that actually comes in the uh, set of die cuts. The ephemera here's this beautiful paper i just arranged all these different elements there is the bow and then these i introduced uh, last week to you those beautiful pearls um these uh flat back pearls and yeah there is my first card and all the materials will be linked below and here is my second card same thing this is a top folding card Happy Easter. Look, just this beautiful ephemera piece. You can see it is cardstock. And um, yeah, and I just arranged the different pieces. This is really a fun set um, to work in a group with. I was thinking I had it all laid out and I didn't really use anything else but uh, the elements in this uh, line other than uh, my glue, of course. And here I have a little bit of a um, outline sticker 
the border sticker which I also carry in my shop but here it is I didn't even use stickles on this one I just left it as is okay then let's go next here is my next one and how fun is this this beautiful bunny here sits amongst the flowers with the Easter eggs here is have a lovely Easter and this is of course from the uh, from the sentiment stickers and all I added here is a couple of buttons a little bit of washi tape and then this this flower and I thought you know especially for Easter it just makes sense to add some of your buttons and all these spring elements that you may have in your stash here I use two papers cannot really see it this uh, paper I used my paper punch to overlap it um, but yeah here is another top folding card so fun okay here is my next one and you got this beautiful have a lovely Easter the reef and again I used some flowers from my stash and that's all it is a panel then just a little bit of a strip here I added this beautiful element and here is my card so I have some of these elements out here so you can see them oh actually this one here these are cut aparts they're in there too and I have cut them apart I don't know if you saw him let's see see there is also a sheet or two sheets actually of these cut aparts that you can use and then yeah here are these elements look how fun they are and so you can tell this is cardstock really fun got these tags and they're all in there twice so you will see them on my cards as well but here these are the ones that I have left over okay and there is uh, another card with have a lovely Easter so you have them like I said twice and I really liked it so what I did is I used this reef twice here um, for a change I I added a border from my border die that I have just to give it a pretty border here on the card and then again I just arranged all these different elements and um, oh yeah I have some uh, pearls here that I some bling I wanted to share with you so this comes from it's actually a Christmas one believe it or not adhesive stones those are do crafts what I like these are long strips of bling and um, you can just pull them off and then cut them to, sh to a size and that's what I did on this card here so you can see I just added this one strip of bling and doesn't it look lovely and I, I leave these uh, linked in the info box now here we have another card also top folding and spring has sprung how cute is this I got the happy Easter then there is actually a little bunny that hops around how cute is this added a couple of um, pearls and then just two glitter borders and by the way I have a lot of borders these uh, peel off stickers in my shop in different uh, colors and in different uh, widths and varieties here are just three you can tell um, this is a silver gold but um, see-through and then here I also picked a pink one for today's session um, I link them below check them out there are so many different ones and see this is what they do you can just add one strip of these peel off stickers and it make your card look so finished really nice by the way these cards are up for grabs uh, as a set of cards I do um, 
put them up for sale for a very uh, value price, for a very reasonable price. Uh, that way I can um, bring more and more to you. Um, unfortunately, my little boutique where I sell these cards is no longer there. So I hope that um, if you know somebody, this makes also a pretty present or uh, feel free to a sell and there is no angel policy so if you like my cards check them check the link below then i made mini cards so i had a lot of leftovers already strips that i cut into and i made a few mini cards and these mini cards are i, be, I believe three and a half by three and a half let's see they are yeah, three and a half by three and a half. And it's really nothing about in there. And then I made matching envelopes for them too. But I thought these are so cute to have. I like to add them to my orders. A thank you notes. Here's another one. Really, really quick. So I think this would be a great uh, set to craft with your whole family. Just put all the items on the table and then just start putting them together so much fun so i also have three of these mini cards and the bling comes from again from the um half pearls that i introduced last time i oh, will see if i can find them and here they are so you can see they are flat and and on, on one side and then beautiful pearls in these beautiful colors light pink light blue and then in a pearl color and some even have some bling like this one here it's got a little diamond cut or it has this pearl finish and of course you can match these papers beautifully with our uh, toppers so with our easy 3d toppers and that's what i have done here so i used the paper to make a mini slimline card so here is the six by six sheet and I just folded it in half. So it's a three by six card. And then I added one of our easy 3D embellishments. And this one happens to be so, so cute. Look at these two little creatures in the egg cup, the bunny and the chick. And this one comes from the pack uh, called the Easter bunnies. So, you by now you probably know my easy 3d toppers from holland these bags have 10 of the die cuts in there with three layers each so when you layer them with foam pads you get a little bit dimension on your card so what i have here is right here this cute little chick in a cup in the egg cup and when you open it, I added again a little panel in here so that you have that also for, you know, it looks a little bit more finished. And um, yeah, and as my panel, I just die cut one of these beautiful papers and added it to the paper. Have a lovely Easter is one of the stickers that you get. Now I have so many different spring and easter easy 3d uh, packs in my shop here is the flowers in spring so these this pack here also i made a couple of cards first of all this one with these beautiful tulips in this rusty can and i again i used one of the papers i love this six by six you make a quick mini slimline card i added again one of the panels is another paper spring has sprung and wishing you a happy easter so pretty here is my embellishment this is uh, like i said it's coming from this pack here you can see the layers and then i also added a sentiment a bow and one of these little bunnies springing around spring has sprung i thought this is very uh, fitting and since i had this uh, 3d toppers out i have also made this one 
and here again we have this beautiful paper made into a slimline card and this cute little bunny here it's got light glitter on it I punched a heart out of another piece of paper from the paper pack happy Easter here what I did is I just uh, added the sticker to another piece of uh, cardstock cut it then cut these uh, tails and edit it to my card and of course you can see there he is so yeah I have a lot of these beautiful easy 3d toppers in the shop right now a lot just came in so I think I'll probably make one more video with all the new 3d uh, toppers I hopefully get this in before Easter but um, I have so much fun uh, making these cards because I love spring and these are such beautiful colors. So I had mentioned that I have two paper pads for you today. This one here is from Echo Park also 6x6 six six, and it's called My Favorite Spring and look at these beautiful papers in here it just came in and i have not crafted with it yet so in this one you have 24 double-sided papers and you can see the papers here and then uh, also the the back side now we're not going to go through this right now uh, the video would be too long but i will craft with it this spring this is not just easter but it's called spring and it has a matching ephemera pack and yes, we're going to go and look through the ephemera pack really quick so that you get an idea what ephemera you get in there. And look how beautiful these pieces are. I just like this. Um, ephemera is really easy to work with. You don't need anything else. You just arrange the different pieces, build little scenes, or just use one. This looks like almost like somebody stamped on it so pretty got some um, flags there so yeah ephemera is always fun also if you are into journaling then you can use it to decorate your journals very springy i like it and again, this is Echo Park, and it's called My Favorite Spring. And I wanted to show you this really quick. I have not crafted with it yet, so stay tuned. There will be something coming up soon. This is all I have for you today. I hope you like the cards that I have created with this new line called Farmstead Easter. I sure had a lot of fun, and you can see these beautiful spring colors and these fun papers so if you liked it i would appreciate a thumbs up also leave me a comment if you can and share this video with your crafty friends and family i would really appreciate it but this is all i have for you today please stay or get well and happy crafting i'll catch you next time with more spring and easter cards bye bye